Yeah, wake up and smell the fucking coffee. You're gonna get mad. Call me and my gay flag. Rainbow motherfucker. Mm hmm. I loved her, but I felt sorry for her. I loved her, but I felt sorry for her. She had another lover. Addy, 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 addy. You see? The profile with the white chick, Rebecca Ann Wills. Tell you about her. I don't hate her. She's the mother of my fucking kids. And I won't try to hurt her physically. I murder her. That's what OJ Simpson did. Yes, bitch, you killed your wife. Mm-hmm. I met Rebecca Ann Wills. Ocean City, Maryland. Same year, 1994-1995. Mr. John Rehacks him out. Don't let her inside. She's on the age. That's about she's 19. Somehow she's not 19, man. So I say, okay, little girl. The guy will see you on the age. He said, no. She's I'm 19. I say, get the fuck away from here, chick. And she came back. My friend brought her back. Merrick Williams. Merrick Robinson. A.K. Barfly. Brought back her and her friend named Lauren. Lauren was at 19. Rebecca Ann Wills was 17. Show me an ID. I said, okay. You said, can I get you some weed? That was her trick. He said, okay, get her some weed. She ain't a fucking nigga. Mm. But at that time, her nigga boyfriend was in jail. A nigga named Zeus. Beat and do the fucking thing when I do that. You think it's nice for me? To tell him all this stuff? Fucked up? Yes, all my kids, I miss you. It's a fucking issue. I'm gonna hide behind my fucking eyeglasses, crying, wiping my eyes with a fucking tissue. Thirteen fucking years through blood, sweat, and fucking tears. Now we're gonna talk about her parents. Bill Wills, Mr. William Wills, and his wife, fucking bitch, named Sue Wills. They had two kings, two kids, three kids. Dan Wills. Jennifer Wills and Rebecca Ann Wills, the youngest one. Kicked her out of their house when she was 15. I would never do, I would never do such thing to my youngest motherfucking kid. She bust her father head of the fucking stone. Mm. Kicked her out of the fucking home. Pretty beautiful blonde, long legs. Motherfucker. And I tell you, she never tell me a shit about that. How she bust her father out of the fucking stone. Mm hmm. Kicked her out the fucking home. Then her and her boyfriend, Zeus, rushed her father violently, tried to fuck him up. <clears throat> she was smoking weed, taking the cocaine, but not really addict. But she got a cocaine and had it. That fool we fucking met. Placed her in jail and placed her in a drug rehab. No all that fucking love we had. No, I had a belly dancer. Mm-hmm. Yeah, belly dancer. Julie Nichols. Born in South Africa. As soon as Nelson Mandela took over. They rushed to America. Mm-hmm. So I had her with me. No shit in City Maryland. I told Rebecca about her. I don't care. I love you. She's too old for you. 
Rebecca Ann Willis was 20 years younger than me. Mm-hmm, motherfucker. But she was a nigga lover. Wanna get her parents pissed. That's what some hot young white folks do sometimes. They wanna rebel amongst their parents. He or she go hang with the niggas. Mm-hmm. That's what the fucking did. So now, Julie Love to drink, where she get tipsy, bump on grind and blah blah blah. And just for the record, when Julie and I met, <laughs> she got a fucking soon to be ex husband, a San Diego sheriff, always talking and stalking me. And I shaved every fucking thing. So I said, oh honey, give you a read on breath. Gave her that read on breath, and off there she went. Mm hmm. Queen investment. But she said, Mouse, you can't come to my workplace. All them Middle Eastern guys, you know? Negroes. Black like fuck. What they call us bush niggas? Mm hmm. Bush niggas? You gonna call us bush niggas, motherfucker? They are desert rats, sand niggas. It's no racist shit. Motherfucker. That's how it is. Well, any fucking way I'm there. I said, Julie's flying back tomorrow. Mr. John reacts a mouse, man. Please, don't bring her back in my fucking club, man. She's 17. I said, come on, damn, man. You got fucking jealous. He said, no, mouse, man. I got two clubs. One is called the night life, all the all ages. This one is called the scandalous night club. It's 21 and up. It's a mouth just for you. Make sure she don't drink. So she's backstage while Julie's out there dancing on the floor, having a good fucking time. Rebecca said, mouth, look at her. Look at her. I ain't gonna get drunk and dance with a man like that. I'm younger. I'm more beautiful. I love you. Love me? And they hide my fucking kids? Mm hmm. And lie to the police or punch and beat you as soon as you lose the ain't got a fucking bruise. So you gonna talk about that? Next fucking day, Julie flew to California, back to San Diego. Now, people were going to Savannah, in Georgia, different state line. He said, let me call my dad. I didn't know I'm leaving town. But I never fucking knew that. Oh, the bitch is fucking on the edge. So if I took her across the state line, I'm going to charge for statutory rape. Like what like they fuck up them niggas back in the fucking days. Jack Johnson, Marito, White Woman, or some shit like that. Back in the 18, blah, blah, blah. Send that nigga to prison. Chuck Berry and all these motherfuckers got railroaded with them young fucking white chick who acted like they fucking over the fucking the age limit. It's called the father. So, yeah, my son some big world. My daughter told me that you're going to take her on tour. Oh, she's mighty fine, girl. My youngest daughter. You going to take care of her, yeah? Say yes, sir. Mm-hmm. What's she gonna do? So, well, you know, I like her. She's gonna sell some t shirts. <laughs> t shirts, huh? Yeah, fire the beautiful little white bird. Niggas dream. Mm -hmm. So I said, okay. I said, bye. I'll haul out you back. Full we'll court in Savannah. We're on the way to Hilton Head. I went to Hilton Head, man. It's a clean fucking place, man. Like Peter, like, like it's a golf paradise. Mm hmm. Murphy. A nice club. Just on this fucking club. Murphy said, Mouse, she's a young one. I said, Now she's 19. I said, Oh, you think so? Half a club, blah, 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 blah. On the road. Da da da, every fucking thing. I bought her her first fucking pair of sneakers, Reebok. Mm -hmm. All she had was a fucking 
purple and blue fucking little duffel bag with nothing in it. Mm hmm. <laughs> and a fucking Doc Martin booth and a socks and a shorts and a fucking t shirt. Remember that shit? Well, we never fucking know. The danger was fucking bird that Mr. Bill Wills gave to me. Mr. Bill Wills was pimping his fucking daughter to get pregnant for Eco Mouth at 17 fucking years old. What if I said, bitch, go the fuck back home? They would have thrown throw me in jail for statutory fucking rape. Mm hmm. Now she got pregnant. So damn. Pregnant, huh? So when I was leaving the fucking Moonlight Beach Lodge, car's bad. Mm hmm. Southern California. I said, honey, I'm pregnant. What should I do? <laughs> so I look at her and say, baby, I love you. To run Ishtak Hilton, fucking mad genius. Your mom was about to abort you. But I brought you in the fucking world. But you'd rather listen to your mother and don't talk to your father. Let me tell you my kids out there. I did nothing wrong. Music is my first fucking love. I hate your music. I don't want to be with you. Why? Next episode, when I got two <laughs> kids, I intercepted a Valentine's Day love letter. I'm going to send to a boy named Zeus, who was in jail, the bitch. What you fucking do? How much time I got left? Two fucking minutes. Mm hmm. That's what you did. I was a good father and still a good fucking father. Motherfucker. Thirteen fucking years. Blood, sweat, and tears. And the stone that the builder refused is now the head cornerstone. My first kid, of no fucking mad genius, represents Florida in mathematics at 15 and came fifth nationwide. At five fucking years old, skip kindergarten, I went to first grade and while in first grade doing 12th grade mathematics. Billionaire gym boss, multi billionaire Todd fucking in the garden. All you motherfuckers out there saw my fucking kid. I'm jealous motherfucker, gym boss and mouth. I love that kid, I need him. To do all the books for the Lakers basketball team. But when I hear about this shit, are you gonna wake up and smell the coffee? Bang ding ding. Yes. My kids, I love you. But I'm not no fucking deadbeat dad. Bang ding ding, motherfucker.